Hi everybody, welcome back to Day of the Tentacle Remastered. We join Hoagie here, uh, back in time, 200 years ago. Uh, I cannot remember what to do here whatsoever. Um, there's no great, there's the fireplace here, and uh, there's a smoke detector, which is actually just like a canary uh, with a bell. And we have to somehow warm up John Hancock. We need to somehow put something into the time capsule. I mean, that's something we haven't actually tried. Do we just try to put some stuff in the time capsule? Thank you. This is exactly the sort of thing I need for the time capsule. I'll bury it tonight and it won't be seen for hundreds of years. Future generations are in your debt. Really? Whoa. Wow. <laughs> okay. So, does that mean we can just go back to Laverne now and go back upstairs? Like, is that... Oh wait, he's got to bury it tonight though, right? Did he say? Did he say he was going to bury it tonight? What's the easiest way up here? Oh, we can't get into the door up there. That's right. We have to go back this way. Um, we still can't get those humans to escape either, right? That's another thing that we're working on so that we can get down into the... Is it this door? Aha! Look! There's... Uh, hey, it's vinegar too! Oh, there we go. I knew it. I knew it. All right. Um, I don't know why we didn't try that before, but anyway, something has given. We now have the vinegar that we need to give uh, back to Hoagie. Um, a lot of people are mentioning this, and I did not realize that this was a thing, but apparently I don't need to go all the way back to the Chronogon. I can actually just do this. I'll just run to the Chronogon. Aha! Oh my god. Oh my god, that's incredible. That is incredible. So now I can switch back to... Oh, and he's back where he was. Oh, holy shit. Holy shit. What else can we put in the time capsule? Anything? Disappearing ink? No. Chattering teeth? What the hell do we have to do with this chat with these chattering teeth now? I don't remember. What's back here? Oh, that's right. It's the kitchen. There's a water pump here. Did we fill... Up the bucket, yes, we did with water. And then what's out here again? This is like the laundry room. We've been in here, but I think we've gotten everything we need from here. Okay, fine. Let us go and give this to Red. And then all we need is this golden pen. And I don't remember how to... Can hey, I just pick it up? your hands off that. Have I tried picking this up? What do I want to do with the... Disappearing ink. Can I do that with the it's quill pen? It's already got ink. Because then we could have been like, oh, it's dry. I don't want this anymore. And then taken it. But maybe that's not a thing. Okay, fine. Anyway, we know what we can do. So let's do that now. We're going to go downstairs into the lab and give the vinegar to Red Edison because he needs it, right? And then he just needs some gold. And we know where ah, to get the gold excellent. from. Excellent. I need that for my super battery. Awesome. So we're just missing gold for the super battery now. Is there anything else in here? No, I don't think that there is. There's the bulletin board. All right, well, uh, Eureka, that was great. That worked out pretty good. I think last time um, I stopped playing, or at least in the last episode, I said that we were going to try to snoop around a bit with Bernard because we haven't really done that. We haven't really done much with Bernard, and there could be things that we're missing. Like, have we picked up everything that we possibly can? We still need to get this dime with Bernard. We need the crowbar for that. I don't know what we could possibly give the robber. I've tried the hammer on him, right? I'm pretty sure I have. I'm pretty sure I've tried the gun on him too, but... What the hell do you use the flag gun for? I can't remember. Is there anything in here? The ice machine. I think we have to do something with that hamster too. But I can't remember exactly what to do with it. Okay, that's the sleeping guy. Purple Tentacle is man of the year. Tentacle visits White House. Aw, oh, man. What the hell did Purple Tentacle do to deserve that? Oh, can we push the candy machine? We can use it and we can look at it. Except for those beef squigglies, I got everything I want out of there. I would love to have some beef squigglies, though. What's in here again? Oh, yeah, it's green tentacle. Did we get everything we needed from in here? We tried the it's bowling too ball. It's heavy for me to pick up. There's the mouse hole. 
Was there anything like in... Uh, there's another speaker here. Can we push this one too? No, the stereo would fall. There's a stereo here and there's a video. Hey, wait. Can we actually pick this there's one no up? There's no label. It's probably blank. Oh, hey, we need a... Wait, hey. All right. Perfect. Oh, you know what else is kind of sneaky in these games? Sometimes you have to like close doors because there's... Look at that. Metal Mel. See? Aren't, aren't you glad that I actually closed it? Oh, wait. Hang on a second. What was that? What's this little thing up here? Is, is that a little picture frame or something? No, we can't do anything with it anyway. All right, we got a videotape now. We can turn the stereo on and off. We knew that we could do that. Uh, I don't think we could pick up the bowling ball. Can we actually pick I up the world? I don't need to take over the world. No. Okay, so this is Purple Tentacle's room. And funnily enough, it's still his room in the future too. 200 years later. All right. With the videotape now, we should be able to put it into the VCR here where Nurse Edna is not anymore. And we should then be able to videotape Fred and get the combination to that, right? Because we need to do this. Okay, perfect. So we want to use the monitor, open the monitor, look at the monitor. Okay, so we want to record. Okay. <laughs> Is that enough? Dr. Fred Edison. Oh! Internal revenue. Come with us. We'd like nice. to go over some of your records with you. Upstairs. Uh-oh. Upstairs where? Hopefully not in here. All right. So now we should be able to watch this in slow-mo, right? Should we put it on like SP or EP? It's already at the end. Oh, we have to rewind it all the way and play it. Okay, here he goes. It's in super slow motion now. 57, 101, 999, <laughs> 57. <laughs> Listen, the music's all slow motion too. <laughs> I love that. I love how his eyes go and everything. That's amazing. Dr. Fred. <laughs> this, is, this is amazing. Internal revenue. Come with us. Us. <laughs> That's amazing. All right. So now we know the actual thing. Let's eject our tape, right? Just in case we need it. Where's my tape? Where the fuck is my tape? Ah, uh, you know what? We probably don't need it. All right, so we should be... Hang on a second. Ooh, baby, what a man. Hell yeah, look at that. Look at that. That guy's ripped. Holy shit. All right, so we should be able to actually get this contract thing. Um, and we might be able to get it signed. Dude, he needs to sign it, though. How the hell am I going to get it signed? All right, let's try it anyway. Okay, let's open the safe. Let's see, it's 101-99957. Oh good, I didn't have to do it myself. Hooray! All right, let's pick up the contract. We have it, and let's look at the contract. The, the first part shall hereby be known as a crazed maniacal genius. Nice. Okay, um, can we like phone this in or something? I don't remember what to do with this contract. I'd the rather phone. not. No. Okay. Do we have to like phone the place? No, we have to use the the Swiss bank account. We have to use like the Swiss bank I'd account with the. I'd rather not. I can't remember what to do with this. Do we have to get it signed, or do we have to? Oh, we have to send. We have to mail it, don't we? All right. I'll put it in the mailbox right now. That's right. Put it in it's the no use. We've already missed the deadline. Oh sh shit! Okay, fine, no problem. I'll use the chronogen. Ah, oh. man, fast chronogening is the way to go, isn't it? Holy shit! All right, Hoagie, we're gonna send it in this time here, and then we're gonna make everyone in the future rich. Is this gonna work? There is a mailbox here. I doubt they'll take it without a stamp. Oh, sh shit. 
shit. Okay, we need to go get a stamp. I wonder if the chattering teeth will work with that hamster. We have to make the guy mad, I think, so that he leaves. What are some ways that we can make him mad? Also, do you think that this textbook would work with Laverne? Let's give it to her. Does Laverne need any whiteout, invisible ink, or anything else? I don't think so. Okay, what do we have here? We have the chattering teeth. Okay, so we have to go up to do something with Cousin Ted. Hang on a second. Can we, like, lift this? Do I need to fucking... Hang on. Let me just try something. I need some rope or something, I think. I think I have to use the pulley on the roof with that guy, but I can't exactly remember. The only rope I can think of is that extension cord. I don't know if I can pick it up now once I've put it down. Like, maybe I put it down. I was too hasty putting it down. Can I actually pick it up? I don't want to mess with it. Okay, it's scratch that then. Up now. Can we send this trophy over to I like... I don't think so. Oh, no, we can't. The crank and the can opener, we can, though. All right, Bernard. We have to go see weird uncle or cousin Ed or whatever his name is. And we need to somehow get a stamp from him. Um, we can either make him really angry. That might work. Or uh, maybe do something in the past so that he's never born. Like, I don't know. Like, maybe kick Red Edison, like, in the gonads or something. Stamp album. Pony Express stamps. Yes, not the most valuable kind, but they have a lot of sentimental value to me. Oh, yeah. Okay, let's pick it up. Hey, don't touch my stamps. All right, let's keep getting him mad. Hey, don't touch my stamps. Will it work? Hey. Hey. Don't touch, don't my, touch stamps. my stamps. Okay, that does not work. Oh, maybe the invisible ink on the stamps. Okay, maybe the invisible ink will work. Who's got it? It's him. Okay, it's been flushed to Bernard. Okay, let's pour this ink on the stamp hey, album. Hey, wanna see a neat trick? Oh, yes! Sure. Neat, huh? Oh my god, he's gonna go fucking nuclear. Uh, oh. My Pony Express stamps. You ruined my Pony Express stamps. Not to mention <laughs> five years of therapy. Get out of my room. Jeez, what a grump. He should really try to find some outlet for those... Nuclear meltdowns? Oh, nice. Okay, perfect. <laughs> Negative <laughs> feelings. Hey, what's this whole stamp album? We can actually pick this up now, right? Wonderful. And a stamp, which we totally need to send back to Hoagie. Here you go, Hoagie. What the hell? Can we actually take some stuff out of here? No? What happens if I go in here Get now? Get out of here. I need to do something with the hamster, I think, though. Uh, let's scare him with this gun. Hey! Leave the rest of my stuff alone and get out of here. Oh shit. What do we do with the hamster then? Alright. Well, we know something that we definitely can do. So let's put the stamp on the contract and put the contract in this the mail. This is no good. It isn't signed. Son of a bitch. Who's going to sign it? Maybe we can get one of these dudes to sign it. What was that? There's like something... Oh, it's like one of these little stink things. <laughs> it's like a little stink cloud. Fucking, how are we going to get this signed? There is a quill pen here that we can get it signed with. Let's try to sign it with the pen. Hey, keep your hands off that. Come on, I need to sign this. Maybe I can, like, replace it with the Constitution. I don't want to. Okay, maybe I can put it into the time capsule. I don't want to. Come on, Hoagie. Live a little. Maybe we can get Thomas wanna. Jefferson to sign it. Maybe we can get John Hancock to sign it. I don't wanna. What the hell? Maybe we can put it in the suggestion box. I don't wanna. I wonder what we can do with this smoke detector. We can only look it's at it. It's a little cage with a canary in it, perched above a little lever. Huh. Maybe we have to give it to Red Edison, get him to sign it. Because I think he's on the only... Red, Fred, or Ed that we can... He might actually sign it. 
All right, here you go, Red. I don't wanna. What the hell? Come on. Maybe we have to send this to Laverne so that she can get future Fred to sign it, right? We're gonna need a pen though, unless he has a pen in jail. I doubt that that's gonna be the case, but let's try anyway. One of these Freds needs to sign this thing. And present Fred, unfortunately, is being interrogated by the... Oh, hang on a second. All right. Zed, can you sign this, please? I don't think so. All right, then. You know what? We're going to send this back to Bernard. All right. We're jumping around a little bit here. But the IRS guys took Fred up here, right? They said we're going to need to speak to you upstairs. Say, what's the filing date for a BFD 206ZZ insufficient credit applications form? Oh, my God. You have until midnight on the 12th working day past the first full moon after the end of your fiscal year. Holy crap. Dude. These guys are hardcore. Are what is it? Uh, are you guys brothers? What have you done with Dr. Fred? What have you done with Dr. Fred? We've got him safely locked in the next room while we go over his books. Oh. No, you can't go in and see him. And Why not? Think about staging some kind of rescue. Come on. Who's your tailor? Who's your tailor? <laughs> Very funny. Uh, are you guys brothers? Are you guys brothers? At the IRS, we're all brothers. Nice. I'll just be moseying along. Keep how can I good. get in there? I know how I can get in there. It's what something you to do. Your name was again? It's something to do with that stuck window, isn't it? Okay, we can get up there to see Fred, but we're gonna have to fix the window. I think Hoagie's got to somehow fix the window. There was the cat squeaking bed thing as well to get the mouse, but I don't know what we have to do with the mouse. But anyway, we'll figure it out. So we have to go down here, and we have to go in here, and then we have to go up the fireplace. If we can do that with Bernard? Can we do this with Bernard? Does the fireplace work? Yes, it does. Okay. Up you go, bitch. There we are. Something to do with the pulley, isn't it? Okay, let's look at this closed window. It's locked. Uh-oh. Oh, look. There's Christmas lights here. Ooh, what keen Christmas lights. Can I actually pick up the Christmas lights? No, I can't. I wonder if I can, like, cut them with the scalpel. I better not. My scoutmaster warned me to be careful. What, with Christmas lights? All right, let's open this window. I can't. It's stuck. So maybe we need the crowbar for that? Let's smash Gosh, it. Gosh, why don't I just use the other window? Okay. It's already open. Oh. <gasps> oh, of course. Look, he's all tied up and he's red. We have to somehow... Okay, we need this rope. Let's pick up the rope. Okay, this is the rope that we need. All right, Dr. Fred. We can revive him with the funnel. See, he's still asleep, right? He's been no taken up here. No time for fun now. I've got to get him out of here. Okay, I know just the thing. Okay, we're going to go out the window. We're going to use the rope with the pulley. It's all flooding back to me. The rope with the pulley. Excellent. And now if we go, can we climb down the rope? No, not right now. Can we just, like, use the rope? I don't think we can. Okay. So now we have to go back down. Oh, man, this is going to be great. And we have to tie the rope up to uh, Ted, who is red, and who actually looks exactly like Fred. Right? That's why we painted him. I couldn't remember why, but we're going to use the dangling rope with uh, Cousin Ted. There we go. Eh, of course, it's a noose. <laughs> Shit. Oh, my God. Can we actually do anything with the birdbath? No, I don't think we can. I don't think we need to. I think he'll drop the birdbath when we hoist him up. All right. So, back upstairs we go with Bernard. Oh, man. I love it. When you finally remember what to do, it's fantastic. All right. So, we want to use this end of rope possibly um can we actually just pick up the rope or do we just have to pull what it what for okay let's pull it we're gonna pull this rope here we go we're bringing him up <laughs> pull nice 
Okay, great. Now we can rescue Dr. Fred and get him to sign. Where did the bird bath go? What the hell? Can we actually just like climb up the rope now? I don't think that will do much good from here. All right, back up we go then. And we're gonna do the old swap -a doodle or as I like to call it, the old swap -a upstairs. Or maybe it's the old switcheroo. I can never remember. Anyway, let's go in the window and let's pick up Ted. I wouldn't know where to put him. Let's use Ted with Dr. Fred. Nice. No! <laughs> Shit. Hmm, thought I heard something. Everything okay in there? Yeah, yeah, fine. We're, we're good. Yeah. Well, try and keep it down, okay? Okay. Man, poor Dr. Fred. Getting done for tax. The worst. Okay, now we have to use the rope with Dr. Fred, I think. Is that right? Yeah. Okay. Perfect. We're tying him up, and then we go out here, and we pull this rope, right? We're gonna pull this rope. All right, Bernard, no, do your worst. I'm not gonna make that mistake again. Oh, I see. He's gonna go to the other side. I thought there was more to figure out. <laughs> Poor Dr. Fred. Come on, Freddy, you can make it! Through the window! <laughs> Jesus Christ. All right. Puzzle solved. Dr. Fred, are you okay? Dr. Oh, he's still Fred? Out. I'd better get him to the lab. Okay. Now we know exactly well, how to revive him, here, him. But he's out cold. Don't worry, Bernard. We're all over it. We're going to put the funnel in his mouth. And we're going to pour some non decap wait normal coffee into the funnel to wake him up oh man here he comes i mean that's exactly what happens to me every day when i drink coffee as well see i just ping off the walls and stuff and start going crazy it's Damn excellent good coffee. All right, he's back in the room. So that now means that we should be able to get him to sign the contract, right? Please just sign it, I for Christ's sake. I got the contract sake. for you to sign, Doctor. Sorry, I don't like to sign things that I haven't read. What the hell? But the whole human race is at risk. But the whole human race is at risk. Of it's course, always something. that's why I'm busy trying to think of a way to save it. I Jesus. don't have time to read. Now leave me alone. How are we going to get him to sign it? Okay. It's time to use the flag I'd gun on not. Dr. Fred. That did not work. Um, do we want to use the disappearing ink mm, with the contract? Not enough. Let's make him read the stamp I'd rather album. not. Okay, he does not want to read that. Should he watch the videotape? I can't use a videotape with that. Oh, we got our videotape back. I don't remember getting it back. How about some chattering teeth, Dr. Fred? That's a Dr. stupid Fred? thing to do with a perfectly good set of chattering teeth. <laughs> Damn it. How about we hit him with a hammer? I'd rather not. How are we going to do this? Will I you don't remember please what to do. sign this contract? I don't sign things I haven't read. Uh, but the whole human... It's okay, okay, so read so it first. Read it first. I'm busy trying to think of a way to save humanity. I don't have time to read. You said now that leave last time. Me alone. Okay, what about Will if you we please appeal sign this contract? I don't sign things I haven't read. Okay, sign it or I'll get real mad. Sign it or I'll get real mad. And do what? Not be <laughs> my friend anymore? <laughs> ha ha ha. What an a-hole. Damn it, who's gonna sign this thing? We can't get Red Edison to sign it. We can't get Zed Edison to sign it. It's gotta be Dr. Fred, and then we have to post it with Hoagie. But how are we gonna get him to read it? He doesn't have time to read. Should we show him his Swiss bank book? 
that has nothing in it? He doesn't want that. No, I suppose he doesn't. Okay, let's stick him with the I scalpel. Not. My scoutmaster warned me to be careful. Shit! Oh, that sucks. Who could use a stamp album? Uh, oh, maybe we can actually burn the stamp album I don't in the fireplace. Risk damaging these in the chronogen. Oh, okay, so Bernard has to keep the stamp album. That's interesting. And what about Laverne? Is there anything that we can send to Laverne that she could maybe use? Chattering teeth in the glass. The horse. I don't think that'll work. We got this. We got this flag gun. Uh, we can like try to scare. Oh look, he walks over to it if we're in the in the room. That's interesting. All right, I've sent the flag gun to Laverne, and the idea is that we want to potentially scare all of the people out of the jail with this flag gun. <laughs> all right. Sit. I don't think so. Stick him up. Okay, it didn't work. Should we turn this back on, do you think? Can we actually talk to these guys? Maybe it's just a dialogue thing to get these Best guys to go. not bother them. They're busy cheating. Right, uh, okay. Zed? Zed? I'm tired of talking now. It's oh, been yeah. a long day, and I'm only human. Human. I remember. Okay. Um, there's nothing else here really that... Should we read the textbook to him? The LALR compiler is constructed by the following method. First, develop a rigorous elective grammar. Please, no more yeah. science for this family. Oh. No more science? Does that mean that you'd like to read something else, maybe? Do we have to... We've already used the textbook with Hoagie to get the horse to fall asleep. I mean, maybe we can burn that, too, in the fireplace? <laughs> Shit, I don't know. I can't remember. All right, Hoagie. It's all up to you, baby. We're going to need to use this on Red Edison. The LALR compiler is constructed by the following method. First, develop a rigorous electric primer. <laughs> Stop! That book's starting to put me to sleep. Oh, I see. Okay, so the clue is that you can start to send people to sleep with it. Oh, meanwhilst... Maybe we should add a rule that you can't dump sludge into the water supply. What manner of fool would do that in the first place? You're oh, right. Oh, that's a great idea. We definitely need that to be added to the, com to the Constitution, I think. All right, anyway... We're going to go in here. Um, ben Franklin is out and ready for the electrocution on the battery thing. We definitely need this log. Maybe we can replace it with the textbook? I'd rather not. You know you want to, Hoagie. I mean, come on. Maybe we can send Thomas Jefferson to sleep with this. Thermodynamic flux induction circuit design is perhaps the most fascinating branch of practical electrical theory. Please Come on, stop. Tommy. You're making me quite drowsy. Well, don't stop there. Look, if you fell asleep, we could have done something with that. What do we have to use on the log? Or we have to use something with Thomas Jefferson to get him to give up that log. We definitely need the log. Give me this. Sorry, I'm saving it. Give it's me that. It's going to be a famous log. What the hell? And we can't do anything with the Constitution. I don't think we need to do anything else with George Washington. Um, all right, Bernard. It's, it's up to you, Bernard. Or maybe not. We need to somehow get that crowbar from the dude, too. But I can't remember how to do that either. Let's go have a li another little look around, see if we can find anything new. I feel like maybe the novelty guy is... We have to do something, but I can't remember. There's this big hole here now that we can just walk over. There's a Bernard-shaped hole. Should we look in it? It's a hole shaped like me. I'm not proud of it, but there <laughs> it is. <laughs> nice. Do we need to, like, fill it with some cement or something? Like, maybe? Possibly? Here, maybe we can, like, give this contract with the guy here here take this contract i'd rather not all right maybe i can make you fall asleep here have a stamp i'd rather collection. not no here how about you have some chattering that's teeth? a stupid thing to do with a perfectly good set of chattering teeth 
We can't send the brush or anything back, I don't think. We can try, though. We can, like, try to wash the car. I don't think I can put that in the chronogon. All right, take this textbook too, Bernard. And you know what? Take the boo boo be gone too. All right, we're loading Bernard up with everything that we have in hopes I that we can. I don't think that would look better white. Okay, let's read the book to him. The LALR compiler is constructed by the following method. First, develop a rigorous elective Man, grammar. This is like the new turning Man, the battleship. Guess you don't need sleeping pills if you got that around. Now go away, kid. You bother me. Oh, crap. Do we need to use, like, the brush on the windshield or something? Let's try to give I'd it a little, not. little wipe. No? What else could we use on this guy? Nothing. We got the tape here. We got the stamp collection, which we can't chrono, John. What, is, what does Laverne have on her? She's got the gun. She's got this crank. Okay, let's send all this stuff back to you. Just in case something works. <laughs> We're just flushing like there's no tomorrow. All right, what else do we have? We've got a crank now. We can try using I'd a crank with the filthy old car. Or maybe with the dude with the mask. Do you want a crank? I'd rather not. Try some crank. No? Uh, we got the gun. We got a fork. I'd rather man... not. I really want that crowbar. Oh, you can actually... Hey, do you mind? I'm using this. We can actually do something with the crowbar, though. That's interesting. What could we possibly use on the crowbar? The coffee. Hmm. I don't know. It's powerful stuff. What about on the actual car? Hmm. I don't know. It's powerful stuff. Okay. What else could we use on the crowbar? Maybe like the hammer with the crowbar? I'd rather not. Fuck, I cannot remember what to do here. It's driving me nuts. There's the... Uh, there's like the parking lot here and the... No, there's the the ooze bit over here, right? Like we might be able to... Ew, there's like a lot of pipes dumping green sludge here. Do we want to like... Um... Reminds me of the last time I had the flu. Do we want it like a... F no, we can't really do anything with it. We might be able to fill up this coffee pot with some sludge. Decaf wouldn't help there. No, probably not. We probably need something new. Is there anything else like over here? Oh, shit. Well, once again, I am a little bit stuck. Um, and I'm not quite sure what to do next. I don't think that there's any like loose threads of things outstanding now. We might have to just like do like another fucking sweep of the house, I guess, and see. Um, but we can definitely do that next time. Excellent. Well, as usual, thanks for watching and I will see you next time.